Hi guys, welcome to the channel. My name is Mina and today we are continuing some more of the 100 baby challenge. In the last part, we gave birth to twins and completely maxed out the household. So currently Jade can't get pregnant until one of the kids ages up, but it's also a Friday. So nobody is aging up. <laughs> Anyway, if you guys are new here, I'll be linking the playlist in the description box below so you can get caught up or you can just start from here. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Why is her homework just like floating here? Yeah, we're not going to worry about it right now. Just go cooking. It's a Friday. Go cook. Go practice your not. Go practice your cooking. Let's maybe do some of this party size so that we can have we don't have to worry about food and we can also get our skills up which means that she might be able to age up and out of the household relatively soon. And then we also need to work on her skills, not her. We also need to work on her skills, getting her one skill to level four. So what is that currently? It is creativity. Can I have you come here and play dolls with your sister? The toddlers are asleep, it seems. Mom, we need you to go to sleep too. <laughs> Just go to sleep. Just like, go to sleep. <laughs> I know it's a Friday and it's early, but we just need that done. Why, why are the homeworks floating though? I got everything, why are the homeworks floating? And then I also forgot that um, Geralt was a spellcaster when we decided to have a baby with him. So I, one or two of these, for sure one of them is a spellcaster. You know what, we would love to go to the Spice Festival with you, but um, She's really tired and she's really angry for some reason. Meet new sibling, meet new sibling. How many times are you gonna meet your sibling? Oh, she actually likes her siblings. That's a first. Unwanted sibling. Okay, she likes one of them, but not the other. And she's also sad because she, I guess she's no longer the baby. So that's why she feels kind of sad. We might be right on track. <laughs> we might be doing really good from here on out. I know in the last part, I got a little frustrated. I didn't mean to. It just kind of happened. I'm not quitting the 100 baby challenge. I actually really want to see this out. I really want to finish this. So sorry if I kind of gave you guys a little bit of that impression. I'm not quitting. I'm still here. I just got really, it was really frustrating there for a few minutes. How do I get these to not be floating? Because that would be amazing. You need to go back to sleep. Why is, why is she is, Opal is either sleeping in the toddler's bed, like, because they can sleep in the top bunk over here. What is that doing? We're just going to get rid of that. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and go into build mode and like stop these from, okay, so we managed to get the books to stop floating. So I'm going to go ahead and fast forward through this and get her, try to get her, why is she sad? Lingering sadness. Negative thoughts aren't always easy to take off or shake off. Like shake it off <laughs> like Taylor Swift. Oh, why are you eating that? You're not hungry. I mean, I guess you kind of are. I guess we'll let you go to bed. You did make us food. We do need to get that up to level three though. Are you tired? You're kind of hungry. So why don't you come over here and get some leftovers. Take a shower because you real stinky. You a real stinker. Oh yeah, you are definitely stinking. Okay, after you're done with that, also take a shower and then just go to bed. I kind of don't want Opal sleeping in her mom's bed because we have bunk beds here that she can go sleep in. Of course, the baby had to just go and ruin everything. Since this little girl is up, she is hungry, so let's go ahead and get the food out for her. I don't understand why they go all the way over to where the mom is at and go and cry. Because she's crying from low hygiene. She's like, Mom, please bathe me. I swear, Jade is like the worst mother. <laughs> go eat, and then your mom will give you a bath. So let's do bath, please. And then let's have you go ahead and do some painting since you're not clearly not going to sleep for a little bit. A lovely lullaby. When a baby needs to sleep, mommy loves singing them a sweet lullaby, a soothing and soft music to slowly bring them into the arms of Morpheus in the most peace peaceful way. Oh, that is so, I love um, better babies and toddlers because you get like these really cute emotions or whatever they're called. You are also hungry. Well, I need you to work on that painting though. Oh no, the baby is crying, but we're, Ruby needs a bath though. Did Ruby reach le thinking level three? Hold on. Oh man, so all she needs is potty and imagination and she's ready to be aged up. This one, all it needs is imagine this one. <laughs> I'm so bad. So we're gonna go ahead, finish giving her a bath and then take care of these little crying monsters right here. These crying monsters. I'm so bad with the babies. 
I think Ruby just reached level three in all her skills. Okay, okay, this is this is awesome. We need the cake out, which I think they ate some of it, but I believe the candles are still on there though. I don't know if it's gonna work, but we're gonna try. I don't understand why they keep eating the cake when the candles are on there. Like that's a bug. Like that is 100% a, a glitch, a weird one. Candles help. Um, Ask your sister Hazel for some help. Actually, in, no, ask your mom for some help. That is so cute. Let's see what she looks like. Here in a bit, I'm gonna be doing makeovers of all the ones that are aging up, but I just wanna do it, like get it all out of the way. No, she's gonna be gloomy, Ruby, no. Okay, but we gotta pick one of these. Pick a number between one and seven. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Okay, so she wants to be a grow up. Another grow up? She looks super cute. That is so cute. I love her little pigtails. She looks adorable. Lonely recess. Why don't you ask other kids if you can join in? Yeah, do that. She really needs to pee. And then we're gonna send her straight to sleep. You are low on fun, so why don't you come here and just start playing games? You are tired for some reason. Or I know why you're tired. You were up getting your skills up. We're doing fantastic, I feel. Everyone's doing just absolutely terrible right now. Like every, all of them. And I'm probably gonna go ahead and get, invest in a vacuum cleaner. So I'm getting a couple of the vacuum cleaners so that the kids can like vacuum around and stuff. Amethyst is very hungry. Well, that's, that's okay. Amethyst can eat, can eat that pea and cake right there on the floor. Don't make a mess. I, I find it so cute how they like, Whenever they eat certain foods, they get like chopsticks. That is absolutely super cute. Up, oh, she dropped it. She's still not that good with chopsticks, it seems. Okay, I want you to clean up, grab a vacuum cleaner, and start vacuuming around. Okay, all Amethyst needs is imagination. So let's just have her go play dolls for a little bit. And then when she is done, we're going to age her up. Well, we need a cake first. I love how she's just playing like in the dirt. But for some reason, Hazel has like the hurt emotion. Like who hurt you? Deeply wounded? What did, what did Jay do? They're good friends. Career stay at home mom. Yeah, definitely. What did she do? I really hate how like my Sims will get like randomly like this hurt emotion. I don't know why. Amethyst has level three and everything. Okay, that's awesome. We need a baker a cake. Let's do a hamburger cake. That one sounds really good. Embarrassed? Sims don't like having someone walk in on them. Who walked in on you? Was it your own twin sister? Okay, we really need to get their skills, some of their skills going up. Activity, play with dolls. Awesome, so next time, next time Claire goes to school, she'll be a straight A student. She will age up to teenager. Okay, that's not gonna be until like Monday. But in the meantime, as soon as Jade wakes up, we're actually going to have her go meet some baby daddies. She's still asleep, but we can probably work on something with her. Look at her go, taking her sister to go blow out the candles. Excuse the crying baby, but look at this. It's so cute. Okay, what is she going to look like? I'm really excited about this. Why is she walking all the way over here? No, she's going to be a slob. Amethyst, why? I mean, like, they're raised in a messy house, so of course she was going to end up being a slob. Pick a number between one and seven. Okay, so we're gonna pick three. Creative, she's gonna be a little artistic prodigy, but she's a slob. I mean, artistic people can be messy, right? I mean, I'm not the cleanest person. <laughs> oh, look at that hairstyle. She looks super cute. Okay, let's add candles on these and put it back in the fridge. Awesome, the kids are well taken care of. Mom needs to eat. And then let's go ahead and give them all makeovers so we can see what they look like. As much as I really like this hairstyle, I'm just kind of like not feeling it for her. So we're gonna give her something completely different. I'm kind of feeling maybe something more like this, or maybe even like that. Or we can give her a little bit more of a braided look. There's even this one that's kind of cute. I think she had brown hair. So we're gonna keep her with the brown hair. I know, I kind of feel like giving her this. I can't decide what hair I want for her. I think we're just gonna keep it with that. I think that looks good on her. Okay, so here are all the makeovers. So I kind of just went ahead and did all of them all at once so not to spend too much time on this. Um, but that's her day look, her formal sportswear, nighttime, party, swimwear, hot weather, cold. Not like they're, we're ever really going to see any of these outfits. Daytime, formal, soccer, 
bedtime, party, swimwear, hot weather, cold. Daytime, formal, um, active, bedtime, party, swimwear, hot, cold. For daytime, formal, active, sleep, party, swimwear, hot, cold. I did keep some of the outfits that they were already had just because I wasn't mad at them. There were some that were really ridiculous. Oh, that was a handful. Oh, the babies are still crying. Hey, since you aren't really doing anything, can you go bottle feed? This is why you get a teen as soon as possible. Oh, he wants to finally come and see his kids? Nah, we're just gonna ignore him. He's he's a jerk. We're gonna ignore him. He ain't gonna see his kids. Why is everything literally breaking in this house? And we can't just afford to replace it, so we're gonna do a repair. What are you doing? Do not go see the baby. Do not go see the baby. Just go potty. Stop trying to go see the baby. Go play your dolls. How's Jade feeling? Okay, Jade can go sleep for a little bit longer, and then we're gonna go and look for some baby daddies. What does it say tender no? Okay, so our teen completely failed and like walked away. Your baby needs a diaper changed. That is what your baby needs. Okay, now that everything is kind of like calm, we're able to, you know, walk away. We are going to go ahead and travel to a location and try to find a baby daddy. So I decided to have Jade come here to the Izakaya and Mount Komorebi and see if um, we can find ourselves another baby daddy. But my camera is about to die, so we're going to have to cut it here, leave it off on a little bit of a cliffhanger. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. We got all of the toddlers to age up. We're working on all the skills. It's really exciting, really amazing to see. And I really hope to find a couple of more baby daddies, a little bit more options of who Jade can make the next baby daddy. And yeah, we'll see from there. Go ahead and hit like if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you haven't. And I will catch you guys on the next one. Bye.